This is a video of my homemade EDM machine. It's made or powered by a couple light bulbs, a square wave bridge rectifier, some old motor capacitors, and a drawer slide for the feed. And there's a little knob on the top there, you turn that to feed it down. And the motor is a 3 RPM gear motor and the headlight switch there, I use the dimmer for speed control. And it works alright, except for small electrodes, the power feed just doesn't work quite as well as the larger ones. But you basically turn this knob. So it does something. Oh, too far. Back off. It is touchy. Well, I got an improved version I'm planning on making, but... Sometimes you can get it just right. Other times you... So I'm trying to hold a camera too, it's pretty tough. I use it mostly for burning out broken taps and it doesn't get used very much. But these small electrodes are sort of a pain in the butt, and there's no flushing of the of the uh, particles out of the electrodes. So that doesn't help any either. You can see a light bulb up there; it just sort of Oops, too far. Back it off. This is a larger square. It's so much easier with a large one. The larger the tool, the better it seems to cut. Ah, there it goes. 
Yeah, you gotta find a sweet spot. I'll engage the motor. Let's see. Turn the motor on. Let's see what it does. See the motor's running really slow. And the bulb's getting brighter. There it goes. If it goes full bright, I know it's stuck. One of those burns away, catches up, burns away, catches up. Not too much to it. Made it out of junk parts I had laying around. Yeah, that's about it. Thank you for watching.